called Epic Skies. And I just want you to know that anything is possible. With miracles though, there comes obstacles. So I knew that when I started this, I would be at a place where it would get hard and it wouldn't make sense and I'd get scared. And I had to have something, a manifesto, if you will, that would remind me of what I was trying to do. And so if it's all right with you, I thought I'd share my manifesto with you. It encouraged me when I was doubtful and I hope it encourages you a little tonight. It was taken from an excerpts from a missionary the night before he died for his faith. And there was just something about it that resonated with me. It's called the way of the master and this is just part of it. My past is redeemed. My presence makes no sense. My future is secure. I am finished with low living, sight walking, small planning, smooth knees, colorless dreams, tamed visions, mundane talking, cheap living and dwarf goals. I no longer need prosperity, position, promotion or popularity. I don't have to be right, first, top, recognized, praised, regarded or awarded. I live by faith, I lean on his presence and I walk by patience, lift up by prayer and labored by his power. My mission is clear. I cannot be bought, compromised, detoured, lured away, turned back, deluded or delayed. I will not flinch in the face of sacrifice, hesitate in the presence of the adversary, negotiate at the table of the enemy, or meander in the maze of meteorocracy. I won't give up, shut up, let up, until I have stayed up, stored up, prayed up, and preached up for the cause of Christ. I am a disciple of Jesus. I must go until he comes, give until I drop, and work until he stops me. And when he comes for his own, he will have no problem recognizing me because my banner will be clear. Everything about this is for majestic glory. Amen. Thank you. Yeah.